Waka 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 waka. Hey everyone, Mayhem Prone here from the Mayhem Prone Show, where today, Happy Nightmare Night! It's the beginning of my favorite time of year, the holiday season, and in honor of that, I'm gonna be making a brand new version of the Alicorn Brew. The other day, this weird blue unicorn wandered into my shop and gave me this crystal. He said it needed to be destroyed because it had a terrible curse on it. But it looks so perfect for my potion. And besides, how bad could it possibly be? So let's try it out. Prior experience has taught me that this is not going to end well. Uh oh! <laughs> Wait, what's going on? Why, hello! I am Kimikaze. It would appear that that curse was a bit more severe than you expected. I'm kinda like you, only better. Oh, please tell me you're not another cartoon ripoff. Maybe a little, but unlike that wannabe, I won't have to fake my own death to win. Wait, faked his own death? You realize that Cartoons is defeated several months ago by Toon Critic and Lightning Bliss. It'll be a long time if he comes back, if ever. Oh, your ignorance is unbearable. Any slightly intelligent person who watched the series would find it obvious that it was Cartoons who won in the end. Well, first I must ask, what exactly do we know about Cartoons? Well, while he's not really good at getting along with others, he's a great strategist and he's amazing at psychological warfare. Correct. And with that said, why would Cartoons release Lightning Bliss at the beginning of the final battle? It had been well established that he feared Thunderblight, so why would Cartoons release his greatest threat, unless it was part of his plan all along? <laughs> oh, it's so adorable to see you stumped. And what about the book? You mean the one Aeon gave cartoons that he never read? Oh, you're making this too easy. Now, I like Aeon as much as the next guy, but one thing that he's not is a good liar. Any pony with two brain cells could tell that he was lying. And if you remember, cartoons made it very clear that he always has a plan B. So what exactly are you proposing? Well, it's actually quite simple. After seeing Aeon's attempt at trickery, cartoons became very interested in that book. He read through it, and quickly uncovered Toonie's little plan. So in secret, he edited the book to his own liking, and on that fateful day of the final battle, he let Lightning Bliss go, and when he cast that magnificent spell, it unfortunately produced the opposite of its desired effect. Cartoons was put in full control, and Toon Critic was destroyed, possibly forever. No way. That actually clears up a bunch of the plot holes in this story, but it only has one problem. There's no evidence after the saga showing that Cartoons is the winner. Well, once again, you're completely wrong. So to start us off, what makes Cartoons' design so unique? Well, he has a hat, some cool glasses, and a coat. Exactly. So let's forget about the hat and look at Toon Critic's new design. Now, if you look closely, you will notice that Toon Critic is wearing a pair of glasses and a pair of goggles. Both of these share a striking resemblance to the glasses worn by Cartoons. And if you've noticed, Toon's new jacket is almost identical to that of Cartoons. So if the whole saga's point was to eliminate Cartoons and make Toon Critic a new person, why would his new design look so much more like Cartoons? And you mustn't forget that Cartoon Survival is completely canon due to the fact that he hosted the Round Table is Magic Nightmare Night special. He said that he survived due to Lightning Bliss messing up the spell, but that does not explain how he escaped Toon to host the show. But my theory does. So dear adoring fans, would you mind doing me a favor? Make sure that Toon Critic sees this video. Now if I do remember correctly, you were able to convince Lightning Bliss and Finn the Pony to check out Mayhem's TF2 theory, so go and do your thing. Okay, you can be a jerk to me, but don't you dare insult them. And what are you going to do? I've already won. Your theory may be good, but the battle is far from over. For someone who prides themselves on doing a ton of research, you obviously didn't look at the comment sections really long. With the help of the brilliant DJ Silverwings, we have discovered that the real mastermind behind this plot is none other than Aeon. Ha 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 ha!